everybody, welcome back to Whiskey Central. If you're new here, my name is Shayla, and today we're doing a blind sample review. I'm gonna nose it, taste it, give my thoughts on it in a short review format. Okay, let's do this thing. Bam, I'm gonna try to make it quick. That's what she said, he said, I don't know. Ooh, that's a lot of whiskey. Oh dang, into the box. Bam, okay, now we're gonna put it up here. I know you guys don't wanna see like a minute and a half of that, that's really dark. Um, So I was trying to make it quicker. Hopefully that's, hopefully you liked that. Okay, we're gonna give this thing a fancy SJ. <sighs> This, this is dark. This is dark. Let's nose this bitch. Yes. <laughs> Ooh, that smells like a bourbon. I just feel way too fancy in these glasses. This is ridiculous. I feel like this is a bourbon that has a decent amount of rye. Also a lot of cherry. Delicious amounts of spice. Wow, do these really help you nose whiskey that well? This is crazy. I think it's got a decent proof. I don't think it's like super high or super low. It's good like middle of the road, at least from the nose. That's kind of what it's smelling like. Also, I'm using this new glass, so I don't know if I'm getting more flavor because there's more alcohol or because of the glass. So yeah, mm, this honestly smells like heaven. I'm gonna laugh when this is something like terrible, but it smells like heaven, just telling you guys. Okay, there is like so much vanilla, it's ridiculous. Damn, I feel so fancy. I need to get more of these glasses, guys. This is awesome. It smells like orange cream, rye spice, cherry, vanilla. I don't know what the heck it is. I think it's a bourbon with some rye spice. Super delicious smelling. Let's go on the palate. It's very hard to drink out of these glasses, so <laughs> enjoy. Okay, wow, I just got goosebumps. I think the proof actually overpowers this just a little bit, kind of overwhelms the palate. It is very good. I think it's some sort of bourbon with a little bit of rye. I really, really like the nose. Wish the palate was a little bit dialed down so that it kind of matched the nose. I was not expecting it to be that like intense. I think I'd pay somewhere around 60 or 70. I know I say that a lot, but that's kind of the general price range that I feel like is good. Obviously if it's less, I'll say that it's less, but I think I'd pay somewhere around 60 or 70 for this. It's like a solid, it's a solid whiskey. I don't know. All right, let's see what this is. My goodness. Oh, what? Why is this literally the hottest thing? I thought this was like 120 proof. What the fudge? This is 90 proof. This doesn't taste like 90 proof. The oak was like, ripping my face off and I was thinking it was proof. Everything's making sense now. God damn it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> this is... <laughs> okay. <laughs> what? So this is Elijah Craig 18 year, guys. I was gonna say that I thought it was oaky. Well, I said I would pay $70 for this, I think. And I think I would agree with that. Like, I like it. I like that it's oaky. Wow. I thought that it had so much so much proof on it. I just am embarrassed. I guess that oak was just gripping so much. It is super oaky. I just didn't realize it was oak. I thought it was proof. But it's weird because I've had this before in a blind and I knew that it was low proof. So that's weird. See, and this is the great thing about a blind review because I would normally say I wish it was higher proof. I thought that it was higher proof. So, you know, it's, it's, I don't know what I'm talking about. It's fine. So have you guys tried Elijah Craig 18? Did you think it was super duper high proof if you were having it blind? Let me know, comment section down below. <laughs> All right, that about does it for this episode. Oh boy, am I embarrassed. I hope you liked it. If you like seeing me embarrassed, just hit the thumbs up. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you with another one of these next week. Down the hatch, 120 proof, let's get plastered. I'm really good at my job, guys, if you haven't noticed. So, you know, no big deal charge my iPad, son of my bitch. Okay. I feel like that just ripped off this damn car that keeps honking its horn. Yeah, it's this horn, this guy. <laughs> Frick is this? I am just honk, honk, honk. Shut up, please. Please shut up. And right when it's ready, we're going to stop. As Matt would call that a little bit of edging, you know, just coating all of the edges of the glass. What do you think I meant? <laughs>